I'm here at the Palmetto State Armory booth with Matt. They got some mood lighting for us, nice and comfortable with the couches. He's going to go over the new jackals for us. Absolutely. So uh, our jackal lineup's been doing really good. It's been really popular. So we're trying to expand on the line and offer some new things for our customers. Uh, so I'll go ahead and start with this one right here. This is our 308 jackal. Uh, this has been one that we've heard a lot of buzz about. A lot of people want to see it, so we brought it here as a concept gun. Uh, it's the same operating system as our standard Jackal, so it will be a long stroke gas piston operated system. Uh, ambidextrous side charging handle that is non reciprocating. It's also toolless changeover to the other side, so you can easily switch it over to be a right hand charging if you want. Uh, this one's going to work on our PA10 lower, so you can you know, put this upper on any PA10 lower we want. Very cool. Um, yeah, it's a really cool gun. It's one that we are very excited to, to put out. So as for differences from if you have a Jackal already, is it really just a big difference as it's a different caliber? Other than that, there's no big differences? Well, you know, it will be beefed up a little bit, obviously. Yeah. You're using a bigger round, so we had to change the, uh, the receiver, the handguard, uh, definitely you know, stuff inside the carrier and bolt. But, um, you know, it is base principle Jackal. You know, so it's it as function-wise, it goes the same. Absolutely. And then as far as I'm aware, this is kind of a, a voting thing, right? A popular, who, you know, which ones are most popular you guys are going to put out first type thing. So these are kind of concepts to let you guys know what you potentially are going to be making. Absolutely. So everything that we're showing today, uh, they're concept guns. They're stuff that we've been working on in R&D, but yeah, we're trying to figure out exactly what our customers want so we can prioritize what we're going to release first. So um, everything you see in any of your videos, yeah, if you go on palmettostatearmor.com, we'll have a poll up. So Very you can just cool. go and vote through what you want to see. I think you can pick top three, so it'll okay. help us kind of understand what our customers are looking for, what y'all are excited about. Yeah. So one, I think that is super cool that they're doing that, finding out what the customer wants, not just what you guys want to produce and everything, and that is very neat. So I know you're going to ask me, I know you're going to ask me in the comment question and everything. Pricing-wise, we're not going to know until uh, we get further down the road and actually find out what we're going to be choosing and, and release dates and everything. Uh, so once we get that information, I'll gladly share it with you guys as well. So that is the 308 Jackal. Uh, we got a couple other offerings as well. Absolutely. So the one I got right here is actually our Olkin. It's a uh, another cool gun, I think. You know, Jackal's been doing good, and every good gun needs a bullpup, right? So uh, this is essentially just a new lower for a Jackal. It'll take any standard Jackal upper except for you know our 308s right now. Um, really, it's just a really cool gun. Solid aluminum lower. It takes all AR fire control groups. Fantastic. Amb ambidextrous mag release, which okay. is a cool little feature that we've added in. Uh, it really just brings the gun in, makes it nice and compact, a smaller footprint for anybody that wants a little bit smaller of a jackal. Yep. Is this going to be more AR controls, like your, your safety selector? Where are those all located at? So safety selector will be on this side. Be okay, right so just like your AR file? Yep. And you have, a, you know, just like any other... Um, little pub, you'll have an op rod that runs from your trigger that actually interacts with the fire controls, hammer, and whatnot up here in this portion okay. of the firearm. We've done a lot of things to try to make the trigger pull as, as good as we can. You yep. know, it's kind of a stigma with bull pubs, bull bag pubs. triggers, but uh, I think this one's really good. We've got a couple other things to work on, maybe, maybe make it a little better. Awesome. Very cool. Are you guys looking at a lot of different barrel lengths? So I know it's early. I know they're concept guns, but is that something that you guys are going to do as well? If they get cho chose, you'll pick different barrel lengths as well? Yeah, so uh, you know, especially like with the 308 Jackal and the Vuk, um, well, more so the 308 Jackal, we're looking at probably releasing it in our standard barrel length right now. So uh, 14, 5, 13, 7, and 16 inch. Awesome. Um, you know, if there's any real demand, if anybody's screaming, "Hey, we want something different," yeah, obviously the PSA is going to listen, and yeah. we'll uh, we'll start producing whatever you guys want. And you guys have been fantastic about listening, obviously. With um, you tell that you guys are putting out some awesome concepts, which is cool to see at the show. So. What about this one? I need to know about this guy. I hope you're enjoying the SHOT Show content. It is all brought to you by the channel sponsors, Brownells, Tecto Knives, Locks and & Company, and Howitzer. So please go show them some love and support because they support the channel and allow me to do the things I do here. Brownells is the Amazon of gun parts. You can use code TA10 to save 10% off orders $150 or more, and that code is limitless. You can use it as much as you want, share it with your friends, and have fun with it and save money on some bills. Tecto Knives has a great selection of knives that I've been using for months. I've been using them every day at work, and I've had really Really good success with them. Also doing a giveaway of those here soon if you would like to win one. Locks & Company makes products for your hair, your beard, your skin. They make shampoos, deodorants, body scrubs, a lot of other things as well with really natural ingredients, which is why I really like them. And they're also doing a Tactical Advisor hair product as well. So stay tuned for that here very soon. You can use code Tactical Advisor and save 10% on your order. Howitzer is a clothing brand that donates 5% of proceeds to charity and they collaborate with me with my own Tactical Advisor t-shirt. Link in the description if you would like one. If you like giveaways, take a look at my Patreon 
and memberships here on YouTube, and you guys can join to win some really cool things. Let's get right back into the SHOT Show content. Oh Lord, so that is the Vuk. So this is kind of an extension of what we were working on last year. Um, it'll be kind of a new gun. It will no longer be just a standard Jackal upper, but it will be kind of the same principle as Jackal with that long stroke piston, ambidextrous, non-recept side charger. This one will actually sit on a one of our rock and lock lowers. So it's gonna be very similar to our KS lower, except for the fact that it actually has a built-in stock adapter on it. So okay. uh, you know, nothing that we need to bolt into the back. We also have a front size, front sight combo for our gas block up here. Same eight position of adjustability in your gas block. Um, the initial release is gonna be in 5.56. That's uh, one of the more popular and common calibers right now. We'll look at moving into some of those 7.62s and 5.45s in the future, but obviously with ammo availability you know, being what it is, yeah, 5.56 is what we're looking at initially. Awesome. Now for fire control groups, it's all AR as well? Absolutely, it will still cool. take the standard awesome. AR-15 fire control groups. So you guys can use your favorite triggers and everything in these, but awesome set of live. I'm very excited about these. Thank you so much for going over this with us. Absolutely.